Okay, so sometime after, for these flowers, I put white. And you couldn't tell by the white, so then I added the color flesh or peach, I don't know. And then, you know, added like on the sides, like how you did right here. And you add it on the sides, and it makes them look so real and kind of cool, actually. So you do it like this, so you like put it on the sides and on the lines, and it made it look more real. So now we actually need to do the brown. So now we need to put like branches. This is Ma, the, you know, you know, it's kind of, I can't say it, but you kind of figure it out after I paint it. So we're going to paint like the branches, branches at the top and at the bottom. And we're going to use this brown. I can't say the name. Oh, I can't really say the name. It's also acrylic, obviously. We're going to find out. And then we're going to use this brown. I think it's called burnt umber, something like that. Um, I don't know if you can see the other one. Well, they're both types of brown, so so we're just going to paint all of these things, okay? Some branches later, so wait, let me get right here. Okay. So you do the branches. It looks like black, but I assure you it's brown. So now we have to do this thing. I really forgot what it's called, but I, I well, we'll see, okay? So if you notice right here, these branches have like a type of grape or something. And so these ones, it's kind of sloppy right now. Um, I'm kind of planning doing them about a reddish pinkish, like something like that. And for the plant of the macaws, okay, I, I love macaws, they're really pretty birds. So this one's going to be like that blue with like yellow one. You probably don't know which one I'm talking about, but okay. And then we have this one, which is a red, you know, those bright color red. 